Here we go. Your full weather is brought to you by Key Appliance. Sales and service for major brands including GE, Whirlpool, KitchenAid, Speed Queen, and more. We hold the key to savings and we hold the key also to temperatures like this today. 51 here in Bangor, also Bar Harbor, 45 Millinocket, 41 for Greenville. A very comfortable day. Temperatures did what they were supposed to do for this time of the year. It felt like spring, right? Uh, but slightly colder air gets in here tomorrow and also for Wednesday. Ahead of our next weather system getting in here on Thursday. So we're kind of in between. Between, right? So the really cold stuff is there. The really warm stuff is here. Still 80s across the south today. That's not normal quite yet. And we're in a happy spot in the middle with temperatures hanging out in the 40s to low 50s across the area today. The long range trend though still keeps us below average in temperatures into the second week of April. So if you wanted a quick turn into summer, it's not going to happen for us anytime soon with temperatures hanging out at or slightly below the averages. A very active weather pattern out there analysis system one is right here. System two is there. System three and four behind that. Uh, this one here is our first one, right? That'll likely go to our south this evening. However, it's going to be just close enough here to give us a couple of sprinkles, maybe a flurry out there tonight. That won't be a big deal. Then we'll stay dry throughout the day tomorrow. Also for Wednesday before our next weather system gets in here on Thursday. Let's walk you through. So here we are tonight. No worries at all. Here's tomorrow morning, 11 o'clock or so. A couple of sprinkles, a couple of flurries around and lots of cloud cover. Uh, those kind of clear out of here late tomorrow evening. Here's 11 o'clock looking at just clouds around. We have a nice morning for Wednesday before we have increasing clouds Wednesday afternoon and evening ahead of our next system. So there it is on Thursday morning. That's going to push through rather quickly with a rain snow mix on Thursday. There could be an inch or two of snow in that, especially north of the Millinocket area. That's going to quickly go through and then another one gets on in here probably on Saturday and Sunday. So kind of a wet pattern for us going forward with lots of clouds cover and potentially this weekend lots of rainfall Saturday into Sunday with that snow line pushing further north. Okay, so our snowpack is impact right here we are lots of snow still across our region one inch here in Bangor, but just north of us Millinocket and points northward uh, have lots of snow on the ground. We're going to be melting more of that snow and then adding to it a bit uh, Thursday and then again over on Saturday. So, you know, here we are heading into spring uh, with some more snow in the forecast, but we're used to that around here, of course, as you know, our forecast and for tonight, though, looking at mostly cloudy skies, a flurry or a sprinkle can't be ruled out with low temperatures down near 30. For tomorrow, a couple of sprinkles, a couple of flurries, highs uh, slightly colder than today with highs near 45 and a north breeze around 5. And then looking ahead, your five-day forecast shows tomorrow, 45, lots of clouds, maybe a flurry or sprinkle. Wednesday, quiet, partly cloudy, 46. And then look at Thursday, a rain-snow mix gets in here, the high only of 38 and lows well below freezing. Uh, some recovery Friday before our next system gets in here on Saturday. It's a wet one with potentially heavy rain this weekend. Beth.